Nicole, what are you doing? Just reading a book. What kind of book is that? It has no pictures. Not all books have pictures in them. It's a boy. Nope, these books are better than picture books. What story is it? This one is called Little Red Riding Hood. Once upon a time, in a place far, far away, there was a beautiful young girl, and this girl was loved by everyone. And her grandma loved her the most, and she made her a beautiful red hood. The girl loved her hood so much, she wore it everywhere, and everybody started calling her Little Red Riding Hood. One day, Little Red Riding Hood's mom told her her grandma was sick. She told Little Ra- Red Riding Hood to walk through the woods to bring her grandma some treats. Little Red Riding Hood agreed. Wait, 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 Tukola. You expect me to believe that her mommy lets her walk in the woods all alone? Yes, so far, that part confuses me too. I think because this story was written a long time ago. Let's get back to it. Mm-hmm. Now, about halfway to her grandma's house, Little Red Riding Hood came across a big wolf. But it was a friendly wolf, and Little Red Riding Hood started talking to it. Wait, 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 Sakola. Are you telling me she seen the wolf and he didn't run? Yeah, I was thinking the same thing when I read this story. But Little Red Riding Hood just didn't know wolves were dangerous. Oh, I guess so. Let's get back to the story. Little Red Riding Hood told the wolf she was going to her grandma's house. Because her grandma was sick, she was bringing her treats. Just then, the wolf just got an evil idea. And just like that, the wolf ran off. Finally, she made it. When Little Red Riding Hood got in her grandma's room, something just felt a little bit weird. First, she noticed her grandma's eyes were so big, but her grandma told her that's how she sees her better. Then she noticed her grandma's ears were so long, but her grandma told her that's how she hears her better. Then she noticed her grandma's teeth were so sharp. This time, her grandma said. No, but I don't believe it. Are you telling me that Little Red Riding Hood seen the wolf in Grandma's clothes? I didn't know it. I guess the wolf was in a pretty good disguise. Yeah, that could be. Let's get back to it. And this time, her grandma said. The better to eat you with, and the wolf gobbled her in one bite. Dad. Huh? What? That's it? Yep. No, Suko. I don't like that ending. What do you think should have happened? I was thinking they will rescue themselves. Okay, let's give it a try. Inside the wolf's belly. Little Red Riding Hood saw her grandma was okay, so she came up with a plan to get out the wolf's stomach. Hiya, hiya, hiya! She used karate to get her grandma and her out safely, 
and they live happily ever after. The end. Well, so cool. I like that ending much better. Yeah, me too. Should you do another story? Uh, not today. We'll save up for another time. Okay. Thanks for watching this video. If you like it, big thumbs up. So if you don't subscribe, you'll miss our new videos. Bye. Bye.